Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. Uh, today I want to show uh, the performance uh, for the uh, uh, those uh, new auto trade today. Uh, we started around 9 o'clock, 9.30 and uh, I didn't set daily target. Normally you can set daily target on any given auto trade. Let me take an example here. Uh, you can set a daily target on the swing trade in ES, uh, nailed 5,000. And uh, this uh, type of an auto trade uh, does not require a template. You just uh, set it up and uh, let it go. Uh, those, uh, the, this is the template we released on the CL. Uh, today I did not set the daily target and between winning and losing today what to really we were over 5,000 but what happened we had two major losses in here so we end up with 3,310 and we still have uh, now this is the last trade for today uh, now as we speak we had losses on this Nasdaq but as is the auto trade, uh, because of this losing trade, we were above 8,000 and now we are on 7,225, which today was not an easy day. And let me show you the trades. They are extremely, extremely accurate entry, non-stop, non-stop. Yes, there is a couple of trades, losing trade here and there. But the majority of the trades are winning. It's like ratio 8 out of 10 uh, uh, winning trades. And now this is uh, the trade. Uh, believe me or not, the YM lately has been doing better performance than the NASDAQ. And those are the trades for today from 9.30. And you can see also... Um, which, by the way, the NASDAQ, when we started today, the NASDAQ started with negative, uh, you know, it was down, negative, and then recover and got over 8,000, and now it dropped to 7,000. So the NASDAQ at the beginning went to negative, and then start to go positive. And those are the trades uh, from 9.30. Here they are around 9.30, somewhere around this area. And uh, we had one losing trade, two losing trade, three losing trade, and the rest are winner. We got 5,000 on that. And uh, for the ES today, uh, it's the same template uh, as the one we sent out um, uh, on Monday. But when I saw the market, usually we use five minutes on the ES. When I saw the market uh, very slow, it's not doing very well. So I lowered the time frame from five minutes to three minutes. And uh, now this is the last trade for today. And what is nice about it, you can cover yourself if you want manually and let it be if you want to. Or it goes automatic with the trailing stop like you see. On the YM, there's an automatic trailing stop. So, <clears throat> between, uh, even we had a now loss. You see, there is two losses on the last uh, 30 minutes on, on the NASDAQ, which we were about to hit the 10,000, but 7,225 is not bad. So, we have 7,000 and 3,000 on the CL. I don't want to talk about uh, uh, pocket change. That's 10,000, and uh, the YM 5,000, that's 15,000, and 3,000 on the ES. So those four charts made $18,000 today, and this is very, 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 um, very impressive uh, automated trade. Uh, to all our traders, when you see the market is uh, very slow, uh, we have the CL 
the ones they got the templates we have the cl on one minute we have the nasdaq on one minute we have the ym on one minute so it's a very uh, small time frame but when you see there is uh, the market is not moving to our traders you can lower the es uh, for from five minutes to three minutes or from three minutes to one minute you don't need to change any seven but you can lower the time frame um, the reason we we made a template on the es for five minutes because for safety uh, 16 years experience with the traders with the public we know uh, some traders they don't want to listen that's their problem but uh, we we try to make the template on the ES for five minutes uh, for safety for the amateur traders. But if you uh, uh, aware what's going on in the market, you can switch it from five minutes to three minutes medium, or you can get it aggressive to one minute. And, and uh, uh, it's up to you, or you can leave it on five minutes. But today the five minutes for slow and moving market uh, you're not gonna get anything out of a five minutes of chart so sometimes um, if you don't know the market moving or not try the three minutes is okay you know don't go too low to one minute you can go to three minutes in between the one and the five that will be like half aggressive not all the way aggressive and not all the way say as we see right now the nasdaq uh, start taking the trade i hope this one will recover it and then we can go back almost up to ten thousand. at this moment it is 3 15 pm october the 12th so i mean there is nothing left uh, the market is finished for today we wish you the best thank you very much and we'll see you tomorrow on the other channel bye for now